Hey everyone, this is Alex from Fit Golf TV, and this is my review of the Bridgestone Golf Tour B330 golf ball. Now, this golf ball used to actually be my golf ball of choice because it was just a great all-around golf ball, and I still find myself to this day buying packs of this particular golf ball because it is reliable and it's very durable. Now, first off, what I would like to talk about is the dimple pattern. As you can see, there's smaller dimples and larger dimples. For me, this worked great. But now, the golf ball industry has changed. Everyone is trying to have symmetrical dimples. And as you can tell, the dimples are circular. Most dimples nowadays, like TaylorMade and Cavalry, are not circular. But it's still a great golf ball. And as you can see, or here, it has a very soft cover. Now, my biggest problem with this golf ball is that after a while the cover starts to turn brown. I don't know if it's a mold. I've never had this one other, with any other golf ball. But it's not dirt. It's not scratches. It's just discoloring on the cover. I don't know why. It usually takes a month after gaming for this golf, for the Bridgestone golf balls to turn this color, but I found this has happened a few times with Bridgestone golf balls. And this golf ball for the driver spin at the simulator was about 2,900 RPMs, which for me is pretty good. I, I, I like it. It did not balloon around greens, and for the greens, it was it was just great. It would land on the green and roll back about a foot. Even though, for me, I like the ball just sitting. It's still a good golf ball. For the money, it's 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 worth it, in my opinion. That's why I still go back to it. Bridgestone has always made great golf balls, but yet very, very underrated golf balls. So, for, for this golf ball, I would rank... 4.5 out of 5. The only reason I'm taking 0.5 off is because the covering turning a light brown color in certain spots might be off putting to other golfers and is kind of off putting to me. But if you can get past that, it's probably one of the best golf balls on the market, especially if you cannot generate enough spin on wet shots. So. That is my review of the Bridgestone Golf Tour B330 Golf Ball. And again, guys, this is Alex from Fit Golf TV. Thanks, guys, for watching, and see you later.